toolbox. The math room. Hello everyone and welcome. I'm Jilly. Today we are going to practice counting. Counting from 1 to 10 using insects. Counting how many insects there are. Counting how many parts they have. But first, let's start with the song Counting from 1 to 10 by Dream English Kids. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, jump! 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, jump! 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, jump! 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Great review! Now, let's get to counting. <laughs> counting outside in the garden. It's time to count. How many pots does the insect have in the book? This book is called One Insect by Catherine P. Burdick. Now, how many heads does the insect have? How many middle or bodies does the insect have? How many legs does the insect have? We'll count one by one. And then how many parts does it have all together? Let's count and read the book. One Insect by Catherine P. Burdick The Head One One Head the body, two parts, the body, one leg, two legs, one, two, three legs, one, two, three, four legs, one, two, three, and four. Five legs. One, two, three, four, five. One more. Six legs. One, two, three, four, five, six legs. Let's recap. The head, one. One head. The body, two parts, two. And legs, six legs. One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine body pots in total. Welcome back. It's time to count the different insects, counting from one to ten. How many ants do you see? Six. How many butterflies? Five. How many worms? Four. How many grasshoppers? Seven. How many bees? Three. How many ladybugs? Two. Great counting, and we're done for today. Well done, everybody. From all our friends here at Toolbox and me, Jilly. Bye, friends! Don't forget to click the subscribe button. And if you like it, click the thumbs up. For more episodes with Toolbox.